I know I don't have to tell you this, but I want you to know, because you know this already, healing from betrayal is hard work. Sometimes it's a full-on reckoning. You're questioning everything. You're questioning the entire relationship. Was the whole relationship a lie? Where was I when all this was going on? How did I not see? How did I not know? Your heart shattered in a million pieces. You question every single thing. You're looking back at old pictures and old memories and everything is a trigger and you wonder, can I ever get past this? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Will some days be better than others? Of course. Will other days you'll be like, man, I am at the top of my game? Yes. Other days you're going to feel like you can barely get out of bed? In the beginning, yes. As long as you continue to move through the five proven, predictable stages of betrayal, from betrayal to breakthrough, you will move through all of it. It's not clean. It's not this like gentle, pretty process like this. Not at all. It's like this. You're moving forward, moving back, moving forward, moving back, moving forward, moving back. But you're continuing to move in the right direction. I know when you're feeling, especially if you're in like stage two, you're in shock, trauma. I mean, you can barely function. Stage three, you're kind of stuck. When you're in those you know, stages four and stage five, that's when you realize, oh my gosh, I can use this experience as a catalyst uh, to propel me to places I never would have been had this experience not happened. Now, that's not saying you're going to feel that on every day, uh, but on the days you do, celebrate it, celebrate it. On the days you don't realize you've come so far already, just keep going.